Yo, what's up guys, this is JFKV24 here with the review for these models. So let's get started. Right here we have the Emirates Airbus A380. And I'm just going to be quiet a little bit. You're gonna, I'm just going to go through this aircraft very slowly so you can look at all the detail. The Emirates tail. And got the little winglets if it would focus. There's a little winglet, you can see it right there. The engines. There you go. Got this nice aircraft. Here's the other side of the aircraft. Now let's look at the Virgin Atlantic. 744. It says Virgin Atlantic on the inner winglet right there. And it has Virgin Atlantic. Close the doors. And you can see on this side, same as the others, just with the cargo doors. And you got the Virgin Atlantic on the bottom. Very nice aircraft. Now let's go to the KLM. A lot of people reviewed this model. See right there, nice model, very nice looking aircraft. Nothing on the belly, just mostly plain white. And that's that aircraft. Then we got the Air Canada. Seven eight eight seven eight eight. Nothing on the belly, it's blue. Got the other side of the aircraft. That's about it. I fixed that vet jet. Here's the vet jet right here. See on the winglet. If it wants to focus. Focus. There you can see it says vetjetair.com on the winglet. I think it's the same on the inner part of the winglet. Yeah, it's the same on the end part of the winglet. You got that 9,000 right there. And the vet jet tiles right there. The star on the engines. You got the belly that says vetjetair.com. And then we're going to look at the veterinario of the American. Very nice looking model. Gotta say, very nice looking indeed. Very good choice of aircraft this time around, I feel like. There we go. Why do you say that? It is very nice, all of them. Why? Because the snow is like a bird. No, the aircraft are just nice. Hmm. Then we got the, this one. That I got a pretty good view of. Before. You see the Triple Crown one. And got Southwest titles in the back, the tail part. Got the belly with the heart on it. Nothing on the winglets to look at. This it. The Alaskan. I got this from a dude at it on his airport. It's a nice aircraft though. And now we're gonna take a look. At the boxes, if you could bear with me. So now let's look at this one since it's down here already. You could pause and read all that if you want. This one was a 20. 2003 release. This is pretty old. Then you got the Southwest box. Typical Southwest box for Gemini Jets. This is a 2016 release. Then you got the American Airlines box on the outside. Then on the inside there's the information if you want to read that all. 
You could pause and read that for that one. And this is also 2016 Gemini Jets release, official American Airlines licensed product. Then you got the Vet Jet. You could pause and read that too. This was a 2016 release, not an official licensed product. And you got the Air Canada. You could pause and read that if you want. And then you got 2016 release, an official Boeing licensed product. Then the KLM Orange Pride. You could pause and read all of that information. Let's get a better view for those who want to actually read it. There, you can pause and read that if you want to. And this one, the 2016 release, official Boeing licensed product. And you got the Virgin Atlantic box. You can pause and read that info for this aircraft. And this also was a 2016 release. Official Boeing licensed product. This is official MRS licensed product. You can see right there. Just stand up for this one. Then you could look, that's where the aircraft was. And on the flap, on the inner part of the flap, you got the bottom view of the aircraft. If you flip around, there's all that information. You could pause and read that. And this was a 2015 release. That's all, and I'll see you guys in the airport update with all these new models. Bye.